right up on her face. It was clear. I was clear. It's cool. It's like a good size. It's a good size deal. outdoors here about a month and a half ago we came in and used some Rackroids product to you know try to grow the deer a little bit bigger and get them a little healthier and uh, as you can see they kind of dug it up and whatnot we had a rain not too long ago come through here so everything's kind of just damp right now so we're going to dump out some more and then we're going to go home later on and check the cards on our computer and see if we got any good bucks. <laughs> I think I forgot to mention it earlier but we went ahead and put out some rice bran and a biologic block here up here at this first spot that we came to got our camera set on it right here so let's see what happens last time when we were down here we uh got a couple of trace mineral blocks that you can get at farmers co-op we uh put one in this little tree right here we thought it'd be perfect really and uh we've let it set for about a month and a half and you can see down here hey They've really taken a liking to it, but today we're going to try some of this biologic fool draw right here. And I think we're just going to dump it maybe on this stump right here and see if they like it. We'll know next time when we get down here. They're really liking it. Uh, yes. It's thick. What's the motor oil? Mm, they, they like that. Can get their engines going. Yeah. I'm just trying to keep them, keep them fed and happy. Smells good. <laughs> All right. Well, here's that. Got save one that more. For, What's that? Save that for a good fishing jug. Yeah, you can use that for a fishing jug. Shoot. All right, we got one more little area we got to go to on the property. It's right down this draw here in the creek. We got a camera. We uh, tried a uh, rack one products, the rack roids, and uh, I threw out some protein pellets last time. But we got a camera down there. We're gonna check it and dump out some more rack roids and maybe some rice bran. You know, try to keep them in there. That's what it's all about. What you think about this draw, Chad? I think it's real beautiful. The more beautiful spots on this property. I think a lot of animals use it, not just with deer. And uh, Sam's got him a good spot, and now my mind's going blank. I'm gonna do real good about it, though. And well, we just made it back here to the last spot that we're gonna, you know, put any product out at. Had a trophy rock right here. I had rack one right here, just a product I found at Academy, and I had the rack roids right here. It doesn't look like they've been in it in the past couple days, there's pine needles in it, but they sure tore it up. So we're going to freshen this rack roids up, because that's all I got with me now. I'm going to dump out some rice bran and a... Uh, Put a new car in the camera and we're going to head to the house.
this yet. <laughs> you still filming? Yeah. What are we doing here, Chad? Uh, checking this camera, see if it's working. It's look, it's acting crazy. It's acting crazy as crap. Just like everyone I put down here, tub the moisture. Just like the slow creep. I'm pulling it in. Oh, my camera's getting getting runner if I put it down here. Right. This is, this is going to be a scouting spot. Kind of a new spot that I've not really ever hunted on the border of our property, next to this creek here, and good draw on a bunch of big pin oaks and white oaks down through here. And right up above it, there's spot cut pines with just lanes that grew up in there, and there's deer all up in it. They use it and they use this trail skirting the edge of it from the top of that hill. That's really nice side. trail. So they stick them with these draws and creeks. That's how these deer move around out here heavily, I, I believe. That's how I think we find them bigger bucks. Maybe uh, we can find some more, more spots like this. Uh, trophy rock. Fell off. That's what's left of the trophy rock. Mm -hmm. Now check up under the stump. That stump was once in the ground. And they dug a fish on this side. That's after years of putting minerals and whatnot. They they about got that whole thing pulled out of the ground. And they got a Heavy trail coming from right over there. Something they come goes over there and use a lot of scrapes and rubs down through there. Good transition spot, I think, from down here in these pines where another trail's coming up. You got a deep creek right there that they use. And then I think they, like the other draws I was talking about, stick with it, maybe go around me and come up here on top of these couple humps here, all these acorns. We we'll call that stand up there acorns. And they're falling. They'll be hitting you in the head and falling around the deer, making the deer all scared and they hit them in the head. It's pretty funny. It's hard not to laugh. <laughs> it's a good beat out trail. Oh yeah. It does look like a cow trail. I know they, they, they bed a lot. Back off from this area, back that way. I've used my cameras to figure that out and scout that out. All these bucks use this too, so maybe I can, might move the stand closer this way. I might be able to get one and get one and film myself for a buck around my doors. This is where we had our first racroid site here on the other property that we hunt. It looks like they've Kind of dug it up a little bit. It looks like they might not ha have hit it though for a couple days. We got a camera right here. We're gonna take that card out of there and take it home and see the result. See if there's any bucks on here. This is where I killed a good 10 point last year with my bow. My trees back there. It's a really good spot here. It's a good pinch point between two thickets and on the other side of this thicket 
right here there's a pond so it's a water source they tend to come through here whether they're if there's feed here or not it's a it's a dandy of a spot I actually we're gonna dump out some more racroids here and see if we can't keep them in here though you gotta keep them fed and keep them happy keep them healthy that's what's most important noticed right here there's a decent sized buck track. I'm gonna get the camera and bring it over here and show you real quick. That's why I kind of skipped over this spot when I was dumping some stuff in there. That's a nice size buck track. <laughs> 